Hey, hey, you guys. Good afternoon. I should say good evening. Um, my name is Marlene. This is Marley Grace Creations. Welcome to my Facebook page. And if you're joining me on YouTube right now, welcome to my YouTube channel as well. Thank you for being here. If you're watching me right now on that red button's right there, I'm live. If it's not there, then I am no longer live. You're watching the replay, and I'm thankful that you're here watching the replay. So you just let me know you're here and ask any questions if you have any. And um, I check my messages usually sometimes after a live, sometimes the next day, and I try to answer questions or um, comments. Look at comments. Hey, Diane. Hey, Nancy. Hey, Ava. Hey, you guys. Good evening. I hadn't seen you, some of you in so long. Uh, M-A-R-L-Y, Carla. A lot of people will type in M-A-R-L-E-Y and they can't find me and they can't figure out why. And um, I think it's because of the movie Marley, the dog, you know, the, the golden retriever. Anyway, it's hard to find me that way. Hey, Patty. Hey, Jerry. Hey, Betty. Hey, you guys. Okay, tonight... I am going to do a flower, I know, Carla, it gets worse, it could be worse. You ought to try my last name. <laughs> hey, Ava, what did you say oops for? Spell check, spell check is a doozy. Hey, Betty. <laughs> okay, I have, you know, everybody has these. They're just, I pick them up, they, they're at the Dollar Tree, they're at goodwill they're everywhere but these are really really good flower pots they make good arrangements so um i'm going to paint this one possibly decoupage a napkin on it we'll see in a few minutes i may like it just white i don't know and um we created some porcelain looking china pumpkins today in my private group so i'm going to incorporate those in an arrangement so Hey, Cherokee, how are you? Hey, Diane. Good to see you guys. All right, let me get some paint on this thing. It's probably going to take two coats, and I'm just doing cashew because I don't want it stark white because the pumpkins I'm putting here are not stark white. So, hey, Patsy. And even if I decoupage a napkin over this, it will be, um, it'll be, it'll be good. So, either way. Hey, Diane. This is cashew. This is probably one of my favorites. I use it a lot because it's not white. It's a creamy white, and it dries, um, it's kind of a off-white tan cream, so it's certainly not stark white, so that's what we want is something not so white. Hey, Susan. Yo, I already got my shoes off. It just dawned on me just a second ago. I, do, I already got them off. Got my shoes off. Red crap. I cannot craft them shoes on. <laughs> I mentioned that the other day to somebody, and um, I come in here one day, and I thought, no wonder I can't find my shoes. I have four pairs of shoes under this desk. So I'll be crafting, and next thing I know, my shoes are off. And uh, then I go upstairs and do whatever, and the next day I'm down here with another pair of shoes on. You know, sandals and Crocs and all that stuff. And so, yep, they're already off. Ready to craft. I hope everybody's had a good day. I have. I have had a good day. The weather here is beautiful right now. Hey, Pam. Good, Patsy. I hope yours is. We've had wonderful weather here today. And you guys, when you're hopping on, if you're new, let me know you're new. First time watcher, we love newbies. And let me know where you're from. Um, it's always interesting. I am from North Carolina. I should say North Carolina. Sometimes people will hop on and they don't say where they are and 
they're in the same groups a lot. And next thing you know, is it still hot there, Nancy? Next thing you know, people realize they're almost neighbors. That's kind of cool. Virginia. We are going to do a mission trip. Is it Virginia? I forget where we're going. Not too long. I think it's Virginia, but I forgot what part of Virginia. We're taking a lot of supplies and stuff. coat because this is real streaky. This looks really beige on this uh, pen. I don't know why. Maybe it's my lighting in here tonight. But that looks just as khaki tan to me. Let me make sure I put the right. Yeah, it's right. Ridiculously hot. Oh gosh, I bet so in Florida. Bless your heart. We've had um, a decent day. I haven't been outside a whole lot today, and but the humidity is a lot lower than it has been, so I'm thankful for that. I love these little buckets. These, I guess that's what you call it, little flower pots. You can do a lot of things with these. So whenever you're out and about, Dollar Tree or, you know, garage sale or whatever, and uh, even if they're beat up a little bit, it doesn't really matter. You can do so much with them. Patsy is your neighbor, for real. For real, Betty. I mean, did y'all know that? Or did you invite each other in here? What? That's kind of interesting to know. Is she your for real neighbor? <laughs> Sarah, how are you, girl? I hope everybody's had a good day. Had something good for supper. 104, my part of Virginia. Oh, no, no. Oh, my goodness. It has not been, I don't know, it was like in the 80s today, maybe. And I, you know, I've been in a lot today. So, maybe I'm uh, delusional. I don't know. Yes, for real. Did you invite her in here? Or did she invite you in here? Oh, thank you, Diane. Spread the blessings, girl. I was um, on one lap this morning, and a girl was in her craft room. And, um, she was saying, uh, spread the mess, spread the mess. I'm like, mm, still hot. I was, um, I talked to, well, I watched Kim, a friend of mine, Kim Jenkin, from yesterday's tomorrow, a little while today, she had on jacket. She said it's starting to get cool there. It was like 50 this morning, and she had a jacket on today. I'm like, oh my goodness. She said it was beautiful. So, fall is in the air. I love fall. Everything about it. I like the weather, the colors, the smells, the food, everything, and all the recipes and all the cakes and pies and all the stuff. I love all everything about fall. So jealous, I know you are. What what is cool to you, Diane? What is cold? My sister lived in Florida. She lived in the Keys. And I remember her calling me one time and it was I think in the 60s, and she had on a sweatshirt, and she said she was going to have to cut some heat on. She was about to freeze. I'm like, wow. That is good weather to me. And this will scratch off. It has to cure, so, you know, I may be touching it up. I don't know what I'm going to do with this yet. We'll see in a minute. I think it's probably too... No, it's the lighting cause, goodness gracious. Yeah, it's it's a creamy white. I thought, why is it darker than it usually is? But it's really not. 
Is the lighting weird tonight? No, it's like it always is. I think. You thank you, Carla. Carla, have you been going live? I don't think I've caught you live yet. I've watched a replay or two, but when it gets in the 30s. Oh, it's cold for you. Love cold weather. She didn't like cold weather. She liked hot, hot weather, so I guess that was cold to her. Okay. Now. I'm thinking... Hmm. Not sure if I want to put that on there or not. I'm thinking I might want to... Hey Sue, I hibernate seven months. It's too hot to go out. That's rough. I wanna cut this border off. I don't think I need this border on there. I don't think I do. Hey, Emma Kay. How are you? Gosh, I hadn't seen you so long. I love this border on here, but I don't think, I don't think I want it on this bucket. It's too hard to, hey, Jennifer. I'm not cutting it straight, but I'm going to sand a lot of it off so it doesn't really matter. I think I like that little bit on the sides. Hey, Wanda. <coughs> okay. Some Mod Podge on there. Hey, Virginia. Okay, where's my knife? I know I've had it today, so I probably put it in the wrong spot. Where is it? <laughs> I always lose stuff when I go live. It just never, ever, ever fails. Never does. Let's see. Oh, well, let's just use this. Thanks for the stars. Let's see if I can get this thing off of here. You know. Let's try again. Aha. Okay. I'm gonna move my paint over there just in case I need it again. I'm gonna show you one of the pumpkins that we did today. So that's the reason I'm doing all this blue and white. See that pumpkin? It looks like the, how do you say it, Chinesserie? So that is what we're putting in this, some, some of those. So that's the reason I want all this blue and white. So that's what we're doing. Okay, I'm going to do one side. I usually don't do this big a space all at once, but I think it's going to be fine. Lake Charles.
Okay, Charlotte. Let me get some saran wrap. Hey, Terry. Get some saran wrap. I have to smooth that down a little bit. There we go. Hey, Shelly. This way your fingers don't stick to the paper and pull the paper up and off and all that stuff. So, get a little bit more on these sides here. I have had a good day. I hope you have. and then sand that off and I'll use that half for the other side. So. A few wrinkles and that, I don't care about that as long as the pattern's good. <coughs> now, piece of sandpaper. There we go. My sandpapers. Getting kind of wore out. Let me get a emery board here. This will do it. Oh yeah, big difference, huh? Now it's gonna fall off. Posting pictures of the things I made. This one tomorrow I have to make. All this last <laughs> bless your heart. Carla, I have a page, too, if you want to post them, post anything on that page. Um, it's Marley, M-A-R-L-Y, Grace Showcase, and you're welcome to post anything there you want to. I think I want that lip covered up. I believe I do. Let me just do that while I'm... Well, I, I, sometimes I think so, and then, of course, everything's worse at night when the sun goes down, you know, and then I start coughing, but I just had a cough drop just a little bit ago, and I have some over here, so if I have to, I'll stick it in my mouth, but I feel fine. I feel pretty good. I really do. Uh, for a few days, I did not feel good. I felt like... Uh, I didn't have any energy, really tired, but I'm good. I don't stay down long. If I do, these people know there's something bad wrong with me. Okay, I think that looks pretty. There, it covers the lip up and everything. So now we're gonna get this side. <clears throat> Okay. 
Hey, Nancy. I hadn't seen you in a long time. How are you? I was just on Nancy's page. I go on her page sometimes in the afternoon when, when I catch her live. She's been coming on my page, I guess, for years. Because I've had a page either three or four years. And Nancy came on it a long time before she started doing her own page. So I don't know how long that was, Nancy. Hey, Melissa. Okay, I can't have sticky hands. I'll just ruin it. Okay, let's get it on this side. That's a ran ram. Hey, Melissa. Hey, Jamie. I rub a little bit, but you have to be really careful because you can sure rub a hole in your napkin. I mainly try to press it down, y'all. There's so many ways to decoupage and everybody has their own way. Hope I'm not running that side. I think we're good. I think we are. I just tore it. I did, I did. Let me straighten this out. Okay, I'll have to piece that together in just a little bit. Because that, well, I might kind of rub it back. No, I'll have to piece that later. It'll be okay. Everybody loves this napkin. Thank you, ma'am. It is one of my favorites, but everybody loves it. And I got it at Tuesday morning, and there is, there is no longer a Tuesday morning. So... Trim this on this side a little bit over here. I can use this piece to straighten that little spot up real quick here. Let me see what it looks like. You have to be careful because then you'll tear it again. Napkins are so finicky. Now let me straighten this side out. <clears throat> Good. Thank you, Jamie. Um, where, is that Wilma? I can't tell. Um, it is so hard for me to read names. Um, I wish they would change the color or let you change the color of that sometime. But the writing is white, and if you have any white going on, it just wants to blend in, and it's so hard to see. Hey, Lane. Yeah, we don't have a Tuesday morning anymore, and I loved it. Mostly for the napkins and a few craft supplies. I thought they were a little expensive for some things, but... And the napkins weren't real cheap, but they had really nice ones. 99 Is it really, Jerry? It's just 99 Wow. <laughs> Well, the other 
one just fell off. Why is this one not? It must be stuck in the bottom. Does anybody have a Tuesday morning anymore? Are they all gone everywhere? This won't look like a Dollar Tree bucket when we're done, unless my fingers keep, let's say, a Long Island. All closed, all closed. Hmm, I guess every single one of them closed. I know they threatened for the longest time and then nothing happened and then they were gonna close again and nothing happened and then next thing you know, they're having a huge sale and they're out of there. and clean. Okay, let me get the inside of that down a little bit. There's one in Kingsport. Oh, Pat's here. Are you in Kingsport? I have cousins in Kingsport. Do you know any Easter's? And my cousin did own a Harley Davidson shop, and now he has dangerous teas, dangerous something teas. Um, so he makes t shirts and bags and uh, monograms and all that stuff. But they're all in Kingsport, and my cousin has um, a graphics design Robin Easter group. That's all of my cousins. And she's been there in business for like 25 or 30 years, I think. Humidity is 20. Yeah, our humidity is low. And that's probably why it's felt decent today, you know. So, I think maybe I'm through with the Mod Pod. Just put it up. Found out one in Kingsport also closed. Wow. I hate it because I really like them. Okay, now that was a Dollar Tree. It still is a Dollar Tree, but you know. Oh, that's smoking. Smoking, smoking. Hey, Linda Ward. Uh, uh, Nowakowski. Am I right? Nowakowski. Okay. But I like saying that because I miss my friend. We have two tomorrow, too. Okay. Let me put some Spanish moss in here. You still have, Susan, a Tuesday morning? Wow. You better get you some napkins while they're open, because they're all closing. Ooh, what a loud thing. Hey, Brenda. Welcome, you guys. If you're first time coming on my page, love to know that you're new and where you're from. Thank you for coming. I have a private group. We meet whenever I have a great idea. Sometimes one or two or three times a week. Sometimes once or every now and then, not at all, but mostly at least once. And, um, anyway, we did some pumpkins today that look like porcelain. So, I'm going to show you those in just a little bit. We're going to incorporate that in 
here. Whew. Can y'all see that smoking? It's hot. Get some greenery down in here. He on the let's see, I found some napkins there. So I would use them for my open house. Yeah, there you go. <coughs> Just getting some greenery in here for now and then we're gonna put some pumpkins in there I won't I won't use all the same I'll add just some because I have all different kinds of greenery so I'll try to use a lot of this and then I'll change it up a little bit Thank you, Cheryl. Cheryl, did you make any molds yet? I figured you'd go home and <coughs> go right at it. Dan, part of your, do you use part of your shirt on the container? Uh, no, <laughs> I didn't. Um, the reason I do this sometimes, not all the time, I sometimes I forget, but is because when I put it to YouTube, it helps me like do a thumbnail and put it on the right video and find a video quickly like this shirt, when I see it, associates me with this and the pumpkins. And so, you know, it's kind of, it just helps. It's just my thing. It's just what I do. So, you don't have to do it that way. I'm just kind of OCD that way. But my children will not tell you that. Does not want to go in there. Why not? Move it down in there. There we go. Um, Deanne, there is, if you go to the Marley Grace Creations page, which is, that's where we are. Yes. I was thinking I might be in the private group. If, on this page, if you look kind of up towards the left when you come into this page, it says, some of you has have asked me about the subscription. Um, she'll put blueberries on her ice cream tonight. I might. I have some, and I love it. Love it, love it. I might, Nancy. Nancy's in our private group. So, there's a lot in our private group in here. But it's, uh, it's $15 a month. And we do different stuff all the time, all the time. When I have a great idea, I say, y'all, I'm going to be alive in a little bit. So that's kind of what we do. And, you know, sometimes it's a recipe. Sometimes it's paint furniture. Sometimes it's, uh, we do a lot of praying for each other. We have a napkin club. It's free. It's If you're in there, it's a perk. Um, we have a napkin club. So, you know, we do a lot of a lot of fun stuff in there. We have a sweet, sweet, sweet group in there. Sweet group. Love them to pieces.
Private group, highly recommended. Thank you, Elaine. Elaine's in there. Elaine's in there too. I think right now there might be 27 or 8, 9, something like that. Okay, it's getting there. See, it's getting there. It's kind of like a boxwood. I've got a few more pieces to go right here. And then we're going to stick some. It has been too hot for me to paint furniture. I've not done that in a while. And I miss it. I've got stuff in my garage I've got to paint. But it's too hot. And I think one day it was a little bit cool. And I said, oh, David, I could go out there and paint furniture. I went out there about an hour later. I'm like, oh, boy, am I glad I didn't get all my stuff out and clothes and paint. And, I mean, it's a big deal to get all that out there. So, okay, it's looking good. You have a bazillion. We have a bazillion, too. We're sharing them with each other. That's what we do. So, bless Donna's heart. I don't think she's in here tonight because she has company, she said. But she was just about out of napkins. And she said, y'all, I'm just about out of napkins. I don't know. And so her name was picked this, this month. We did do it every other week. But we've started doing it once a month because it gets a little overwhelming. And it's hard to, to mail stuff quickly sometimes. People work and, you know, so... You have to turn off the water for 15 minutes. What? Who does? Who has to turn off the water, Cheryl? I, what did I miss? <laughs> what did I miss, girl? Uh, so, um, anyway, I am so excited. I know YouTube, people that's watching me on YouTube later, they're going to think I'm nuts. But I have been working trying to figure out how to get good thumbnails on my YouTube. And what's been on there is what um, YouTube picks, and some of them are horrible. I was doing something one night. What was I doing? Making a pillow or something? Did you not? Uh, no, I didn't, Cheryl. I miss that. Um, and a lady, a friend of mine that is where I have my booth, where my stuff is. She said, um, can you change your thumbnail or add a thumbnail? I said, why? She said, well, it's not there. And I said, what do you mean it's not there? She said, well, you're holding up a thing. It looks like a spatula, like you're cooking. I said, I don't, I don't, I don't know when I did that, but that's what YouTube captured. I'm like, oh my gosh. So anyway, I know how to do it now and I'm excited. I did it last night like that quick that quick and um so now i can go change it every night you saw it did you see the difference sue you went to youtube today did could you tell the difference oh the one where i'm holding the spatula up it ain't there now the real thing is there okay i am happy with this so far now Y'all, these are the pumpkins that we did today. I taught these ladies to do this. See these pumpkins? Isn't this gorgeous? It looks like china plates. And it's glossy. And these are just those cheap, cheap little... Go back when you are done. Okay, I will, Cheryl. I will. So I am going to incorporate these pumpkins in here. That's why we got all this blue stuff going on. Because... These little things are the star of the show. <gasps> well, I was getting ready to say I'm going to have to cut this one off. Well, it just about did it for me. Let's try this again. That looks good. I like it right there. I don't want them. I don't want them hid in there. So, okay, that one is too close to that other one. Okay, 
here's one that's bigger. Let's see if we can get this little bugger in there. <coughs> Thank you, Cheryl. This one definitely needs to be cut off. And I'm not sure I'm even going to use this big one. I'm just going to play around here. And I might move them ten times till I get them the way I want them. Okay. I like it like that. And this one. I love this one. Isn't that sweet? It's so shiny. It looks just like a dinner plate. I hate to put them in here because I'm going to hide the bottom. And the last few. Hey, Miss Sissa. Hey, my sweet friend. How are you? Girl, I have not caught you live in forever. I don't catch anybody live. I don't get notifications. I don't know. I don't get it. I just have to scroll around and occasionally I find you. Okay. We did these pumpkins today on my on my, uh, in my private group. Love them. Look at that. Isn't that sweet? Look at the bottom. I downloaded these, this floral on, uh, rice paper and cut it out, decoupaged it on these pumpkins, and then I glossed it with, um, triple thick. It's a mix that I put together. You don't, what'd you say? You don't go live anymore? You don't go live anymore? I thought I saw you the other day. For real? Did you just kind of quit crafting? Oh, it's just been a long time. Nothing happened, right? Ooh, that sounded weird. Let me, I want this stick in there sideways because I want this one sitting there. Yeah, I want that one showing. Okay. I know. I have two. A couple of nights. Well, maybe one night last week. I didn't go live. I felt horrible. And I still have a cough, but I feel better. Need to fill in a couple of little spots right here. Where did you get the little pumpkins? Um, you mean just the, just the plain pumpkins like this? Is that what you mean, Cheryl? Hobby Lobby probably in a bag. I don't know. I don't remember. I get them different places, but I think that size came from Hobby Lobby. They have they have a little bag full and you can get green ones, orange ones, white ones, whatever. And I just get the plain ones. Okay, I want to turn this. I want to be able to see the china look on these. So far, so good. I still don't have that one where I want it. I'll get it eventually. Um, <laughs> two hours today. <laughs> did you spend all your money or did you bring change home? Did you give, did you bring, have change? Okay, I like it now. I like it now. I don't want pumpkins just straight. I want them leaning kind of sideways a little bit. But I want that pretty stuff showing. There we go. Okay, y'all. It's about to get there. This is going to be a short. Let's see. This is different. Let's see if that's too much. Yes, that's too much. That doesn't look good there. Let me just pull that up a little bit. Hey, Donna. Okay, I, I like it just like that. Let me pull that up just a dab. Just a dab. You know what a dab is, right, y'all? Hey, Martha. How are you, Donna? Okay, y'all. 
Now I've got one more thing that I think I might do to this. I had some little extra white pumpkins that I could incorporate and put, but I think I like it just like that. See all the, looks like China. See the clothes? Yeah. So, okay. I have made these out of molds a while back and I can't decide if I want that to be white or gold on there. There's a little bit of gold. Only gold, I, you know, on this whole thing is, um, thank you, Cheryl, is uh, these stems. What am I trying to say? Pumpkin stems. So, I'm not sure. I kind of like... All right, y'all, help me out here. Do you think that needs to be there? Okay, there's without it, there's with it, and it could be gold. It could be cashew, it could be gold. So, gold edges with rub and buff. Okay, that sounds good. I don't have rub and buff though, but I have some gold leaf I can put on there. Gold, the whole thing gold? I'm gonna paint one gold. I have an extra two over here. I have three, so I have an extra one. Let me paint this thing gold and see what we got. Let's do that. And y'all, when you use this, shake it really good. Make sure the lid's tight first. Don't move it around too much, because if you do and you spill it, oh my goodness. Not the whole thing gold, maybe too much or at least gold around the edges of it. Okay. Let's see. What about navy blue with gold edges, y'all? Gold border. Let's give it some, let's give it some bright blue to match all the... Hmm, let's try that. I have one to play with, so. I'll get it right, and then we'll do the other one, too. Cashew with gold. Sunshine Designs. I love your name. S-O-N, shine. Awesome. Put a small flower in the middle. Like that. Okay. I do have some more of these. I can incorporate one of these right in there. Yep. That's what I will do. Thank you, thank you. Okay, here's an oval one. Let's see what this is like. Okay. All right, y'all, let me get the Mod Podge back out. Sherry, welcome, Sherry. Welcome to my page. A look at you wearing your shirt. Yes, it's easier for me with YouTube when I look at, you know, when I go to do stuff. That's why I do it. That's why I do it. I know, it's OCD. I know it is, but that's okay. <laughs> Let's see here. I need some... I don't want to pour. I always pour so much. Let's do it. I'm just going to be really careful. I don't need much. That's all I need. Thank you, sis. Uh, I miss you. Thank you, Jill. Jill, did you happen to get to see how we did the pump, how I did the pumpkins today in the private group. If you didn't, go watch the um, replay. It's fun. Um, and you don't have to download this blue and white, even though it's absolutely beautiful. If you have some really pretty napkins or tissue paper, it worked just as well. And I bought some stuff that the person that I saw do this 
recommended was called tattoo paper. You remember when you were little or when your kids were little and they would beg for those tattoos out of the bubble gum machine and they take it out of the plastic. Hey, Betsy. And um, put it on, wet your skin and put it on and put a damp washcloth or something over it. And then you peel the paper off and there's your tattoo and stays on forever. Well, that's what they used. And I thought, well, how cool was that? Um, but I got the tattoo paper today and it was, uh, uh, $21 for two sheets. First of all, no, that ain't happening. And, um, it's supposed to be a two pack, which still, I don't think I would have done that because, you know, you put it in the printer and you mess one up. Well, there you go. Um, so anyway, I thought I'm just going to go. And keep looking around. I'm just getting some of this excess border off, y'all. Until I see some. And I want to I wanna see it for myself. I want to hold it, touch it, all that. So, Okay, that is too big. Let me get some of this blue off. Yes, that'll be pretty right there. Looks like it was hand painted on there, y'all. This was a good idea. Whoever's idea this was, thank you so much. Look at that. Isn't that pretty? Now, we're going to do one more. They're not going to exactly match, but you can't see but one side at a time. So, and if you put this in the middle of your dining room table, whoever's sitting on the other side, they can see it just fine. So, this way it'll be pretty on both sides. And this will be in the auction too, y'all. So. And today is 22. If you get tattooed too wet, they will run or bleed. Mm. Good to know, Nancy. I'm glad I sent it back. Because that's a lot of money to experiment with something. And I've got too many other options. I mean, I use tissue paper and rice paper and all that. And it's working great. So, I think they can just keep that stuff. Silver. So, outline in silver. Um... Um, the stems on the pumpkins are gold, so we're going to do that in gold with that stinky stuff. <coughs> with this stinky stuff. Y'all, you know, I shake it really good, and then I try to use what's um, in this cap. And if I need more, then I just shake it again because it is so easy to spill this stuff. Probably the decor wax rubbed on the edges would have been easier than this, but it's okay. Yeah, the stems are gold, so 
kind of limits that. But silver would have been pretty too with this blue. This is going to be one elegant little pot, y'all. Not bad coming from the, oh, look what I'm doing. I guess I could have dried the thing first from the Dollar Tree. Very pretty. Very, very pretty. Loving it. Look at that. Let me dry it first before I keep messing around here and it's um resin. I pour molds with resin and made the molds. Actually, it's called castings. I call everything molds. I call the mold the mold, this the mold, but it's casting from a mold. See, isn't that gorgeous? Look at that. How pretty. Now, let's do this one. And that one's getting dry, so my fingers won't stick to that one. That one's dirty either. I love making molds. Thank you, sis. Uh, I like making molds out of resin, clay. I just love them. There's just something about taking them out of that mold. I'll never forget when I started making them. <clears throat> I stood in my kitchen at the counter probably for four hours making molds. I had a tote full. My husband went to work. I was making molds. He came home. I was still making molds. <laughs> He's like, what are you doing? I said, I'm having so much fun. So... Purple Pumpkin is just might have been bumped to second place. <laughs> is that right, Carla? <laughs> oh, girl, you would mess. Um, Cheryl called me today. She went to Hoppy Lobby, and she's going to make her a Purple Pumpkin and some molds, too. She's loving it. This would make a pretty car tag. <laughs> There's not even a place on my new car for a tag. So I can't put one there. <coughs> okay. Hey, Christine. <coughs> Excuse me, y'all. And I'm going to heat this up and bend it just a little bit because that thing is not real flat. So I've got to get it a little bit flexible so I can get it on there. Whoa, there went my things. Let me get them over here. I might need them again. Here's some more of them. I cut a whole page of them out this morning. Oh. 
Okay. I'm not done with the Mod Podge. I need to put some. Did I not put some on top? I did. I did. I did. I did. All right. This is beautiful. I think it is beautiful. This bright blue is so pretty. All right. I'm going to warm this thing up. Let me show you. This is resin, and it gets hard as the brick. I mean, y'all, this is hard. Hard as, as this. Um, I love blue and white, too. I don't have much of it in my house. I get tired of blue real fast and easy. I never get tired of green, but I get tired of blue. So I had blue dishes in my kitchen for the longest time, for several years, and I took them out, some of them, a few weeks ago. Hey, Kim. I'm getting this so it'll bend just a little bit, so. See how it's it's a little bit pliable now? There we go. It's a little bit pliable. So I need to make sure that it... I don't know which one I want, the top or the bottom. I want that to be the bottom. And I use tight bond quick and thick, but I'm gonna put some hot glue in the center. If I just put hot glue on this and that's all, it eventually would pop off. But, um, tight bond, quick and thick does the trick. Oh goodness. Now, I want this to be the bottom. This thing's sizzling. Catching the end. Hey, Mary, girl, you do that all the time. That's okay. You can watch the replay and catch it all, right? Let's get that to stay. That really looks pretty. Thanks for that idea. Look at that. Oh, look at that. Isn't that pretty? Matches the pumpkins. Now, we're going to turn this over. And we're going to heat this one. Let's, let's set it. Let's set it up for a minute. Good to see you, Mary. Thank you. Very elegant. I think it is too. Blue and white just is. And I didn't know what I wanted to do with these pumpkins after they were made. And I kept thinking they either need to be on a wreath or they need to be in a basket or something. And I didn't want to put them on a wreath and then them be outside and get all dark and ugly and, you know. So, hey Crystal. That's okay, girl. You can go back and watch the replay. And all I did, basically, in the beginning was paint that and decoupage um, a napkin on it. And I get this glue all the way to the edges, y'all. A little bit squeezes out. It's a good thing. Remember that when you're doing molds. That is a good thing. That means it's good and stuck. Okay, I didn't put any glue, tight bond glue in the middle, and I put hot glue in the middle. I don't like to mix glues up. I don't think it's good for your glue. I've been told, I don't know. But it sure does smoke. Let me put this one on. It sounds like sizzling fajitas. <laughs> hey, Flayda, how are you? 
Now, we did the pumpkins today earlier in my private group. We didn't do the pumpkins on this live, y'all. The pumpkins were already made, so I started with the bucket, and then I had the pumpkins on some sticks that I put down in some floral foam. And Okay, and even if these are not in the same exact spot, you know what? You can only see one side of this at a time, so it does not matter. Okay, let me get it good and stuck. Is that one staying put? Yes, it is. Awesomeness. Okay, let me get some extra glue. When glue squirts out of there, y'all, that's a good thing. It means the whole thing's covered. And just get a damp paintbrush and just go and get it off. Get it out of the crevices. And there's not much. It looked like it looked worse than it was. Okay, there's side number one. And here's side number two. There you go. So, I think it's sweet. What do y'all think? Do you love these little pumpkins? I love them. And this, um, this was downloaded onto some rice paper, blank rice paper, from a company called, or a page called, oh, I'm going to think of it in a minute, uh, Navage, not Savage, but N, Navage Patch. So, you can go to their page, website, whatever it is they have, and this is a free download, y'all. So, all you have to do is go there, and um, they do some pretty cool stuff. Um, it's a husband and wife. And all you have to do is just download this and print it. And so I printed it on some rice paper. Actually, I got the rice paper from Timu. And um, that's what this is. It's just rice paper. And I'm loving it on there. And the color is true. It's It didn't change. So, all right, y'all. That's it for tonight. That is it. Um, a couple of you asked me earlier about my private group. You can go to Marley Grace Creations, where you are, and at the top, kind of to the left, you'll see where it says, some of you have asked about subscription group or whatever, private group, whatever it says, and it kind of explains it to you, and then you have to go to Marley Grace, Cre no, yeah, Marley's Creative Circle of Friends page, and ask to join, and then you have to answer the questions, and then you have to pay um, it's $15 a month is all. And so, anyway, it's kind of like a couple of Starbucks, right? Um, all right, you guys. Thanks for hopping on. I appreciate you so much. And I will see you tomorrow night. Now, tomorrow night is a church night. Um, and I'm going to have two grandchildren. My husband will upstairs, though. So, it's going to be 9.15 tomorrow night. And I'll post to remind everybody. And, um... It is, it'll be 9.15. That way I won't be so rushed right after church. So, I don't know what night I'm going to do Mr. Scarecrow. I got to cut out some patterns and stuff. And um, I can make the him a pumpkin day because I can give him some pumpkins to hold or something. But anyway, um, I'm going to dress him up and make him cute one night. All right. Thank you so much. I appreciate you. Have a good night. When you post your videos, select never delete. I do. I do. And then I go, I upload it to um, YouTube. Thanks, Sissa. I'm so glad you came on. I miss you. Bye, y'all. See you soon.